So here I am shooting some macro with my Galaxy S3 right here. I'm taking some pictures of this tree trunk right here. Just seeing how the camera handles it. I mean, how the phone handles it. I'm trying to get a shot like. The... Oops. Hey. Hold on a second. Turn around, please. There you go. Trying to get a shot like this. Which is really, really hard when I'm holding two cameras at the same time. Uh, one second. And let's see how they came out. Not bad. And here we have some tennis balls, which would try to shoot like this or something. See how those are looking. So the verdict so far, I'm liking it. Uh, the only problem is you can't take pictures by pushing a physical actual button on the phone itself, like you know, on the on the sides. So you're always aiming for this button on the screen here, and if you're holding the phone in weird positions, it's really, really hard to hit the button on the screen. And so you have to you know contort your hands in all these crazy positions to reach the button. And it's really challenging sometimes. So um, overall, I like the picture. The pictures are really sharp and nice looking, and the video looks good. Um, and the phone is fast and responsive. Um, uh, so I like the I like the image quality. I just I just can't stand having to aim for that button on the screen itself most of the time. So I've been looking for an app in the App Store that lets you get around that, and I found one so far, but it's just not very good. So I have to look harder. Um, it lets you take pictures by hitting the just hitting a volume button. Uh, anyway, so that's all I was going to cover for now.